Hi guys, it's Ben here. How are you all doing tonight? It's another day trip. Welcome to the video. Tonight, it's the lowest tier of games that I've ever been to on this channel in this series. We're at Clapton FC's ground uh, to watch Hackney Wick take on Sporting Bengal United in the Essex Senior League. Uh, so obviously they ground share uh, with Clapton, Hackney Wick. Uh, it's a club that has only formed in 2015 as they merged with London Bari, who I nearly, I did actually, was in talks to do some work with them a few years ago. I think they wanted some help with their social media, which I nearly got involved with. Didn't happen at the time, but I had no idea that they'd merged with Hackney Wick, um, or with the side that became Hackney Wick. Um, so they're new to the Essex Senior League, and Sporting Bengal are actually operated by the Bangladesh FA. So. It's a real East London derby tonight though. It's Newham versus Tower Hamlets just down the road from me. This is in Forest Gate, which is, you know, about a 20 minute walk from the main part of Stratford, really. I mean, I've lived in Stratford for a while now, been familiar with it. I mean, I went to university here as well, so I know the area very well, but um, get some real characters around here. But look, Essex Senior League tonight, I'm excited. Um, I'm on my own. I've been going to Grays, but Big Risk, who some of you might know from, uh, from the channel. Uh, had to work so he couldn't come to Grey's so I thought I don't want to go to Grey's on my own it's miles away uh, from where I live so here we are I'm outside West Ham Park as we speak um, let's go to the game you know, mate? Hi, mate. is there a food van in here at all tonight or? there isn't uh, unfortunately oh, I'll come back in a minute <laughs> no food for me no food van in the ground so we search we search for our skate for somewhere and I can see a place called Perfect Grill right in front of me there it is Gaff me that, I think. So a lamb shawarma has been ordered uh, from this sit-down restaurant. I've got half an hour till kick-off. Uh, let's hope it doesn't take too long. But I'm looking forward to getting my hand on a lamb shawarma with naan bread, fries and a drink. Shouldn't be doing this with my uh, healthy eating plan, but it's football night, isn't it? This is good. This is good. So the teams are just coming out. I've just had to do something that I don't think I've done in about a year. Not finished the meal. Partly because of the time, it's, you know, I had to, had to make the start of the game, but that meal completely stuffed me. I mean, the meat, the, the lamb was, uh, I mean, it was very filling to start with. It was spicy, it was, it was good, it was good solid meat. Not anything to, you know, write home about, but solid meat. Chips were fine. Naan bread was excellent. Naan bread really probably the standout of that meal. Um, not too dry. Um, not too doughy, very sort of crispy, flavoursome. Bit oily, but I don't mind that. Uh, and I couldn't finish it, I couldn't finish it. A bit of salad in there too. Um, £4.80 it cost for a large, I mean, you, you saw how big it was. Um, all round experience, I got in there, ordered my shit. The guy behind the counter wasn't particularly friendly, and I don't mind that. I'm not in, that's all I really want from a restaurant. I, I don't want to be in there for a chat, I don't want to be, I don't want table service, I don't want to be sat down for it. I just want to get in there, get my food quickly, and get out of there. That's exactly what happened. I was in and out within 20 minutes, despite it being a sit down restaurant. Um, shame about no burgers in here tonight. And this is proper non league, this. This is, this is low, low, low. This is Essex Senior League. I might even recognise some of the blokes playing from uni. Um, that's how low we're talking, but that's, that's what it's all about. Let's see how the game goes. I'm going to order the food. What am I going to give it out of 10? Seven. It's seven. It, I like the experience. I like, I like the, the simplicity of it. Uh, I like the price. I like the size. I mean, it filled me up completely. But there was just nothing extraordinary. There was no... I didn't love every bite. It was, it was good. It was solid. The meat was okay. Uh, and as I said, the bread was good. But there was nothing spectacular. Seven, though, is a good score. So both these sides lost at the weekend and Hackney Wick have got a new manager um, just taken charge for his first game today. I mean, I'm assuming it's him. It said in the paper earlier, which I've just read up on, that um, new manager, the former Crawley Town under-23 assistant manager has taken charge at Hackney. So there you go.
can't believe I didn't get that goal on camera and it wasn't even because I was getting a beer either. I just I was texting Harry who says he might come down because he's been in a hole all day. Um, I, got, I put the camera right there, press record, but it just didn't happen. And uh, lovely overhead kick as well, into the ground and just bounced over the keeper. Um, sporting Bengali 1-0 and deservedly so. They'd probably been the better side, had more chances. Um, Hackney Wick got a couple of nice players. Number eight, who almost gave the ball away, but number eight for Hackney Wick um, is a really tidy player. He's got a bit of panache. Oh, they're playing with fire at the back. But yeah, 1-0 to Bengal. So the half-time whistle's going to go any second. Um, to be fair to Hackney Wick, they've played well since, the, uh, since they fell behind. I think they probably deserve to be level. Uh, haven't quite managed to carve out a clear-cut chance. Um, it's not a thriller here. There's, there's not many people here, but um, some decent football. Not, not a terrible standard. The pitch isn't great. Um, but I think there is more goals in this. It's pretty feisty too, which is uh, what you want to see, especially at this level. Um, so yeah, trying to find some sort of refreshments, hopefully a beer, but uh, anything will do at this stage. About to be half time, 1-0. had it all wrong, the clubhouse was open the whole time, I've missed out on a beer for the first 45 minutes. I've been to the bar and I've got myself uh, a Stella for three quid. Absolute dreamland. Uh, the second half is about to be much more enjoyable. Uh, <coughs> excuse me. I'm going to find somewhere a bit nicer to sit uh, or stand and enjoy the second half. Hopefully uh, we'll see a bit of a fight back from Hackney Wick. So this is quite recognisable, the, the Clapton FC uh, stand if you've seen like away days do this uh, this ground for a Clapton game then you've probably seen this uh, loads of stickers all over the terrace um, absolutely empty tonight obviously it's a Hackney Wick game but um, it's cool to be here it's cool to be uh, in this famous terrace and uh, having a nice lager I'll just wait for the second half <laughs> Not the only one filming tonight. Another referee on another day probably buys that and gives a penalty, but as it stands, it's still 1 0 uh, to Sporting Bengal United, and they are the better team. And Harry Hugo's arrived <laughs> in his suit. <laughs> just literally. <laughs> <laughs> you could do it anyway. He's the smartest man to ever Here appear at this, uh, this venue. Yeah, I've had a few dirty looks, I'll be honest. Yeah. Yeah. Well, here your, I am. Yeah, how's your day? Oh, I'm knackered. All right. But this is a great way to end it. I've just seen a, uh, what was 100% a penalty. Was it was it a penalty? I was literally behind I, it. I, I, I thought it looked like a dive for me. He didn't really complain that much. I mean, he bought. No, he did complain. Did he? He bought. He, he drilled past three really nicely, and I was literally right behind him when he, when he did it. And yeah, Smart. He, he did get taken down. Well, it's, uh, it's 1 0 to Sporting Bengal United. Could it be two? Uh, he's got, he's got, is it in? Yes, it is. It's in! <laughs> So you know what I'm going to Good God, that <laughs> brave. It's been, it's been coming. It's been coming. Brave. Couldn't um, tell you who's playing, what game we're at, <laughs> why Hackney Worker playing at Clapton. I can tell you anything why we're here. Right, well, I'll, whilst I turn this off, I'll fill you in. It's a ping, that. Here he comes. He's in. Oh. Wow. He knows John, does he? So off the back of my rave reviews uh, of Perfect Girl, Harry has gone to buy the exact same meal that I did, but the small version, which is a commendable decision based on the fact that I wasn't able to finish it. In for round two. I, I gave it a seven out of ten. Um, rave reviews, obviously. Yeah. I, I said the meat was, was okay, but the naan rev was what really, uh, you know, bumped it up a bit. Well, I mean, let me just sort of... Looks like it's homemade. Oh, yeah. 
Yeah, me too. Yeah. yeah, that's good, man. Uh, so, 2 0 win for Sporting Bengal United. Um, I thought they looked very good, second half in particular. Um, they showed a lot of quality. That number seven on the left hand side was very, uh, very talented, a lot of panache. Uh, the free kick, um, yeah, I've never seen a ball struck so well, that was impressive. Um, but they just controlled the game really well. I thought first half, Hatneywick had you know, quite a lot of decent play, um, but Bengal were the ones that were creating most of the chances in the second half. They dominated really, never really in any danger. In terms of the match day, um, glad Harry showed up. Um, don't have to walk home alone for half an hour. Might even get an Uber. Um, it's a nice ground. It needs a bit of bit of work. We were just saying as we came out, like the, a lot of the signs are broken, and uh, it just needs a bit of love, as, as Harry was saying just just then. Um, but look, it's somewhere that I'd love to come back for a Clapton game, and maybe when there's a full crowd, there's very few people there tonight. Maybe maybe a hundred in the crowd, maybe not even that. Um, the standard of football is okay. It's. Uh, you know, I was saying I don't think I'd be out of place if I was playing right back there. Um, but it was an enjoyable game. Um, yeah, convincing win. That's all. That's all there really is to it. Essex Senior League, the lowest tier I've done. I'll try and do an even lower on this at some point. But I think next week we're going to go to Fulham. Um, but in between that, I'm going Liverpool versus Crystal Palace. That's uh, that's the exciting one that I've got lined up this week. Anfield. My return to Anfield. Uh, first time being there this season. Obviously the first league home game for the Reds this term. Uh, so yeah, I'll see you for that one, but I'll see you even sooner for a preview. But if you're not a Liverpool fan, you're watching this, there'll be plenty more day trips of non-league and football league coming up very soon. Hope you enjoyed this one. If you did, please do share it and spread the word. Uh, drop a like on, leave a comment with any suggestions, you, you know, grounds that you might want me to go to, where are you from, uh, where can I go to, you recommend. And please subscribe, of course, subscribe if you're new. And if you, uh, if you came to my channel via the Soccer Saturday stuff, there's more of that coming. There's more of that coming, so make sure you, uh, you stick around for that. All right, cheers, guys. See you soon.